Watch till the end of the video. I have a very special clip for you. You'll see my 81 year old mom dancing for Christmas. Hello everybody and welcome to Gene's Reviews, movie reviews from a regular dude. I'm going to do a movie recommend today. We as a family have had a great Christmas today. We spent a lot of our day over at my Aunt Joan's house. We went over there this morning and had like a brunch and opened presents and stuff like that. And then we went back over tonight and had turkey dinner. When we got home, we watched a movie. This is a movie I've been looking for for a long time and I actually bought it. I bought the DVD off of eBay and I highly recommend it. It's from 1948 and it's uh, called 10th Avenue Angel. It's an American film. It's directed by Roy Rowland and it stars an actress named Margaret O'Brien. And it also has a very young and beautiful, at the time, for 1948, Angela Lansbury, the woman who played in, in Murder, She Wrote. It's a very, very good movie. It's um, Basically, this is the plot of the movie. It's an eight-year-old girl played by Margaret O'Brien. Her name in the film is, is Flavia. She lives in a New York tenement. And it's during the Depression and everything. She lives there with her mother and her father. And they're really poor. The father's pretty broke. He needs a job. He teaches violin lessons. And uh, she's really a happy girl because she finds out that um, her aunt, played by Angela Lansbury, her aunt Susan's sweetheart Steve is, is returning from a one-year absence. And she doesn't, she's not aware that he's actually been in jail for the whole time because he was involved with some gangsters and stuff like that. She uh, sees a mouse and she gets afraid of it, but her mother tells her that a fable that if you catch a mouse, you make a wish and it will turn into money and they need money really bad. And so she hides the mouse in a cigar box in the alley and uh, the mouse ends up, these guys actually rob the newspaper man who she's really good friends with and she goes and hangs out with the newspaper guy on the corner who sells newspapers and he's blind and these kids actually steal his money and they go to hide it and they find where she's hidden the cigar box with the mouse in it and they dump the mouse out and they put the money in it and hide it in there and she finds it and so she thinks hey this is true mouse turns into money you know if you want it bad enough and everything but then you come to find out that the uh, guy was robbed and her uncle finds out and tells her she has to give the money back so then she's upset because she thinks her mother's you know been lying to her all this time I'm not going to give away the whole movie that's pretty much all I'm going to say about it but it's a real heartwarming really good movie and it was a great movie to watch on Christmas with my mom and my sister I also have a very special oh first of all let me give my rating on this I would give this a 9 out of 10 I loved it Margaret O'Brien was amazing as a little girl actress. She's just awesome. She was kind of along the lines of Shirley Temple, but probably 10 years after Shirley Temple. And I think she was way better than Shirley Temple as a child actress. But yeah, I give this a nine out of 10. You should definitely look for it and watch it. If you're a movie fan and you like the old movies, it's a very high recommend from me. Okay, I got a special surprise for you. We, at the end of this video, in just a couple minutes here, I'm going to show you a video clip of our Christmas. My mom 
actually did a little dance for us in the living room and it's pretty cool. So I'm going to show you that, that to you right now and I will see you next time. Here's the clip. What's she doing, Sarah? What's she doing? <laughs> Show Goldie! Show Goldie, Sarah! Thank you for watching. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and when you subscribe, tap that bell icon so you can be notified every time I upload a new video. See you next time. Yeah!